meet the theatrical Thor. and his polar opposite sister, the Mellow Meshuggah. Thor is a seven-year-old British shorthair, and Meshuggah is a five-year-old Persian. His owner graciously clipped his nails for me before his appointment, but I'm going to take them a little bit shorter, because I can tell that murder is on his mind. Thank you to your mother for trimming your claws before you came. Bathing Thor was a seriously tough job because he is large and in charge and extremely strong. You like the butt scratches. You were so nice when you were in your carrier. <laughs> Acrobat cat. His owner told me that he smells like wet dog, so I promised her I'd get the job done. And of course, at the end, I won this battle. Thanks to all of you who watch and support my content, I'm able to afford some better tools for my clients. I'd like to introduce you all to the Rage Cage. More formally known as the Caddy Shack Vac, this cage comes with several different advantages for both cats and dogs. Now this is not a paid promotion, however I always like to advertise for products that I think would be great for pet owners and groomers as well. Of course the number one benefit of this cage is that I now won't be able to have a cat velcroed to my face. It also comes with a built-in vacuum. So while I am blowing out the hot air with the blow dryer, the vacuum is sucking out the air. In addition to that, it also sucks out all of the hair that's flying off of the animal, which in this case, Thor is shedding a ton today. This cage is a wonderful addition to my shop, as it not only keeps the animal and myself safe, but it also enables me to do a more thorough job on the more difficult pets. After he is dry, I de-shed this hairy beast with the Equi Groomer. This brush was originally invented for horses, but the inventor realized it not only worked on her cats, but her cats actually enjoyed it. From there, it became a universal tool for all shedding species, even rabbits, due to both its effectiveness and gentleness. After his brush, I blow dried the rest of the loose hair off of him, and then I rewarded him with some churros. It's all is forgiven because I got some churro. Okay, wait, big fatty. Holy moly. I know you'll never believe it, but this feisty little dude was actually on sedatives before his appointment. Easy, my sugar. No jumping, okay? Now we move on to Meshuga. Persian cats are known for their relaxed, laid-back personalities. They are not quick to hiss or scratch, even when in the most uncomfortable of situations. They have a life expectancy of 10 to 15 years, whereas Thor, the British Shorthair, has a life expectancy of 15 to 20 years. The reason for this is that the British Shorthair is a healthier breed, whereas Persian cats have flat faces, and that comes with health problems, such as breathing issues. However, I have to say that Meshuga is a pretty well-bred Persian, as she didn't show any signs of respiratory issues, and she also doesn't have leaky eyes, which is something that I regularly see with my Persian clients. After she is dry, I wipe her face and her ears with a hypoallergenic wipe. And then I brush her out with my all system slicker brush and my metal comb. This very well cared for cat did not have one single mat. Good kitty. Do you like churros? After that, I shave out her paw pads, and she was not the biggest fan of having her sanitary areas cleaned up. Cats have a time limit.
Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed The Theatrical Thor and the Mellow Meshuggah.